Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me. We are getting into Halo 5 Guardians today. I'm pretty excited for this one, getting into the second game in the new trilogy and picking up after the events of Halo 4. I'm also a little bit cautious about this one because I feel that this is kind of a weird place as far as the Halo story goes. So with Halo 4, I felt that that game was pretty good and a decent start to the idea of a new trilogy. Um, the only thing is, is with that game, specifically with the story, was that the ending was a little bit kind of, uh, lackluster, for, for lack of a better term, in that I, I feel like it didn't really do a lot to set up some stuff going into this game. The only exception to that might have been the, the reintroduction of the Didact and him continuing to be the villain, although, as I've come to understand it, he's actually not involved anymore in, uh, at least this game. Which is a really strange decision, because I feel like he would have been a pretty good villain such that we saw him between Halo 4 and then also the Halo 4 Terminals. Um, so he's not going to be in this. So I'm not really sure what the direction of this game is going to be. I do have some theories and some ideas, so if you've watched my other reaction videos leading up to Halo 5 here, um, specifically the Halo 4 Spartan Ops cutscene video... Um, talking about the, the events of Spartan Ops and the things that were going on in there. A very well done kind of series. Great, great videos, great cutscenes, told an interesting story, had some, some neat stuff with the characters. I have some kind of idea, I think, of what might come in Halo 5, but the only thing is, is that's, that's related to Spartan Ops stuff. And it didn't have anything to do really with, uh, Halo 4, the Master Chief directly. Which is kind of what concerns me coming into this then, is, is that I don't know where this is supposed to go. <laughs> and uh, what's supposed to come of things, especially now that we've lost Cortana and everything. I don't understand the purpose of it all uh, as far as getting into this and what things from the previous videos, uh, as I've talked about with like the terminals and stuff, how much of that information I'm going to need coming into this and when I'm going to be able to use it. Uh, so I'm kind of excited to see what threads are connected and what things show up and and where the story goes with those things. I'm also a little bit skeptical as far as it, because I don't know um, what exactly, I don't know how much I'm supposed to apply this information, if at all. Uh, and that's kind of the weird thing. The other thing is, is with Halo 5, what I'm looking for in particular is with the gameplay. I'm hoping that there's some more freaking ammo in this game <laughs> for, for lack of anything else. I want more ammo. So hopefully Halo 5 gives more ammo and a, and a halfway decent story. With all that being said, let's jump into it. Okay. Here we are. I think. Oh, I recognize you with the gray hair there. Okay. But this is prior to something because she still got her, her arm there. Why does she have a photo of Miranda, too? What's up with that? Is that supposed to mean something, by the way? Is that supposed to... Uh, is this supposed to be implying something? I have spent enough years with Oni to know the truth. Is this... This isn't really Cortana, though, is it? After all, I well, sure looks like it. They'll order you... to kill us both. Hmm? Okay. This is a weird way of presenting this cutscene. Oh, that's Mr. Lasky. information on these attacks. Halsey is currently in covenant custody on the surface of Kamchata. Your mission Palmer. is to okay. lines, retrieve Halsey and bring her back to infinity. And then Halsey. Be advised, Dr. Halsey is accompanied by Covenant Supreme Leader Jewel Mdama. If you have the opportunity... Well, see, okay, this was really good to see those Spartan Ops cuts, because now I know who these people are. Who is this then? Is this, uh... 
majestic team or whatever the majesty team what the hell were they called i already, I already forgot Osiris. I guess not. It's a different team. So there's a couple different teams. I don't know who any of these people are either, by the way. Oh, you might need a parachute there, brother. Just, just getting right into it. Did I just hear what I think I heard? Hang on, let's see how this pans out. Okay, we got the... What is this, the Spartan Smash? Alright, these, these guys look way more efficient than the other Spartans from those cutscenes. This is way cooler than what was going on in them as far as the Spartans capabilities. I'm pleased to see that. This is what I figured it'd be more like. I wanted to see more of this. <laughs> okay. Real nice. Oh, and the Prometheans too. Yeah. Good lord. Pretty good. Oh, we're getting right into it here. Oh, good. That's uh, really unfortunate. We could have taken him. Let's move. Bail. Keep it Fuck out of my way. All right, how do you uh Full security. Who's who's this? Oh, dope. Oh, that's what is this? What is that? What did I do? That's not what I wanted to do. Alright, reload. I didn't do anything. I just kind of looked at him. Oh, what is this shit? I got a dash. Okay, so here's what you have to bear with me on this one, guys. So, everything that I've been able to learn, which is very little, as far as the control scheme in the last several Halos, is not useful here because I couldn't figure out how to get Halo 5 to work with mouse and keyboard unlike the games in the Master Chief collection which I don't know why they did it like that or maybe I'm just stupid either way I'm not using a controller which is what I'm used to as far as other games but not in my Halo playthroughs so I don't know exactly what the controls are so I this is I don't remember if I had this before this is a, a, a fucking dash okay it's like we're playing Advanced Warfare all over again. That's fine. Oh, I know why they did this. Because they were made around the same time, those cheeky... Uh, okay, never mind. Anyway. <clears throat> uh, shoot. Reload. So, okay, that's the beat people button. Got it. All right, I'm, I'm learning. What do I got here? Yeah, all right, this is the thing I wanted to mention. Uh, what the fuck are you doing here, huh? Shouldn't you be? Uh, this is not the right squad. You're. It's the wrong game. You shouldn't be here. I think. Veil. Vale, I don't recognize you. Who's the other one? Tanaka. And I don't know. Who am I? Oh, that reminds me real quick here. Okay. That's better. Uh, Locke. That's, That's who I am. So Halsey called us? She said there was something big happening. Gave Captain Lasky coordinates to find her. He must be something big. That's convenient. Why did I thought she wanted revenge though, and now she's like, I need Oh, it could be a trap. That's interesting. I guess I didn't think about that. Okay. 
Well, now you guys are fighting. What happened? I, I thought we were... I thought the big thing was that the Prometheans and the Covenant were on the same side. I guess not. God damn it. This control shit's gonna mess me up for a little bit, though, guys. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not... I'm already not used to it enough with the... With the mouse and keyboard. But now switching back, I, I don't have a frame of reference for really what it was in this. Oh, shit. What's the... Okay, there it is. That's... All right. Is there not a... That's Crouch. I thought that was... What's the scope in thing then? Can you not do it? I figured you would. This is a battle rifle, isn't it? Well, those things die easy enough. Also, I noticed, by the way, I actually don't have a ton of ammo. That, that, <laughs> that makes me a little bit concerned jumping into this then. Oh, I really don't want to pick up their guns, though, do I? Alright, well, you die fast enough, at least. Move on toward Halsey's position. I guess it's something I got a squad with me now. That's nice. Alright, a couple of... couple of things. Oh, that thing's garbage, too. I... I fuck me. I gotta conserve my ammo already. It's part one, damn it. Forerunner soldier. Up the cliffs. Get out. Oh, that's new. Hey. Come back. Oh, what? Oh, they got mantling now. Let's get it. It's a it's a new modern game. Yeah, okay. Just teleported through that ice wall. Sprint and Spartan charge. I like that. Uh, okay, what's, I'm going to have to get used to this though. So, here's what's interesting to me. In Halo 4, there was an ability like this. It didn't, it didn't, it functioned similarly. It didn't look the same. I think it like, it was more, it was an ability though. And I thought that was pretty cool. And they just decided, you know what? Let's just make it like that. Why not? Let's just make it fast. And you get a dash. I like it. Okay. I'll do that. Buck, thanks. Even though you're in the wrong game. God damn it, I'm already out. Alright, what do I got here? Oh, okay. So now this is... Oh my god, this is much better. I, I'm out of ammo, but the weapon is better, I can say that much. Okay, maybe, wait a minute, wait a minute now. Shut up. Oh, what? It's got like a lock-on thing too. I noticed that with this one. I didn't want to. I didn't want to jump to conclusions. But it's like it's got. It's almost like the needler. It's it's got the homing ability or something to it. Kind of. Not 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 huge, but it's not bad. Okay. Oh, so is this? What is this supposed to indicate that you got a Spartan charge it? Sure. Wow, I really flanked him on that one. Oh, very nice. I remember you. Oh. What are these ones, though? These are they're just like regular soldiers. What happened to the knights? These ones look too much like people. That's kind of why I ask. Okay, well, we still have a little bit of a problem with the ammo stuff. Not... 
it doesn't look like it's here's the thing here's the thing about it though like part of the problem with the ammo situation in halo 4 is that the promethean guns were all kind of bad and that's why i didn't want to pick them up to begin with i imagine if i actually was able to consistently have them that the ammo problem would be reduced but these are actually not terrible now or the enemies are easier to kill one of the two it doesn't matter which the point is is that maybe this will be alleviated then right the artemis can analyze forerunner systems might be a way to override this door yeah artemis thing one of your old oni toys similar i convinced commander palmer to outfit us with prototypes okay uh, I don't I don't recognize the Artemis. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Is there by the way, is there a waypoint button? Did we figure it out that that's just the way to go? On my mark. Stop it. Uh that's not what I had in mind, but that's pretty good. That's just, okay, so squad commands. Interesting, interesting. Oh my god, they did it. Looks like there's an override. How fucking difficult is this, by the way? This concept. Just make a goddamn button to show me where I have to go. If I'm too stupid to figure it out. Which, most of the time, let's be realistic, I'm actually not. But, every once in a while, even I could admit. <laughs> okay. I'm moving. Where am I going? Bail, you got me? <laughs> Buck? Ah, oh, here we are. The Artemis did the trick. Run. Oh, I gotta try the light rifle though. That's that was the one that was good. The back of the it's Bring jewel the jewel madam. This doesn't have a ton of this has even less ammo though for some reason. Looks pretty cool. Kraken sighted. What do you mean a kraken? Let's... Try more time. Is that an alien? What the hell is that? I guess I can't complain with that. Nothing wrong with a good book. Okay. Our destination is on the other side of this battlefield. I'm curious. I am. I am really curious, though. Uh, what happened where these guys are now fighting? Because, like, I actually, I actually don't mind this. It's, I'm just kind of curious, though. The way that it was set up, especially reaffirmed in the in the Spartan Ops cutscenes, was that the they were very much like it seemed like they were very much working together. And now that doesn't seem to be the case. Well, what is that one? What is that thing? Can you not aim in anymore? What happened with that? So interestingly, in the in the other game, the light rifle was actually it was like a burst primarily but here they just decided fuck it we'll just make it single shot i kind of like that that's i think that's what it should have been maybe all along honestly but it was it was kind of hard to tell which of the versions was better when you because when you scoped in which i don't understand why i can't now but the point is is like it was it was hard to tell whether the burst function or whether the scoped single shot function was like more powerful i don't know maybe it didn't make a difference and i'm just spitballing but oh this is still pretty good though this is definitely the way to go i think but i'm a little bit concerned uh because that's kind of how it was in uh in halo 4 where the precision weapons seemed to be really good and everything else was mediocre except for the uh, the human assault rifle that was actually fine Shit. All right, let's try this one. Oh, something's getting me. Hey. All right. So, 
interestingly, this is actually burst now instead of the light rifle. And the suppressor is just way fucking better, which is really good to see. This weapon was dog shit in Halo 4. And right off the bat, I can see it's a lot better. So, thank God. Thank God they had the fucking foresight to fix the, fix the guns. Specifically the Promethean ones. Although I gotta try the, I gotta try the Covenant ones now. Because those, <laughs> those still might be really bad. But... Man, it was like the only problem I had with Halo 4 was just the ammo and the weapons of it. Otherwise, it was like, fine. So, this is better already. Thank God. Okay. Stock up. There's plenty here. Oh, here's the Knights. Well, I concentrated. I just beat him in the back. Alright, what's... Oh, she's down here somewhere? You're not so fucking tough now that I got ammo. You notice that? Oh shit. Me and my big mouth. Very good. We move on Halsey and Jewel. Alright. Now I'm here's the thing. It is the first level. Maybe they'll explain much more. I I'm really fascinated by why Buck is here though. When what? How does how does one become a Spartan if not through like? Because I thought Spartans were like enhanced. You know what I mean? Eight foot tall super motherfuckers. You know what I mean? And Buck was just like a regular. I mean he was an ODST, which was like a sleep. Yeah, that was like a special ops marine. But, like, that doesn't make you grow two feet. What the fuck are you doing now? How'd you get in this squad? Can anyone just join? Oh, oh there we go. the finer points of casual reconciliation Born human sarcasm. i like that he speaks english now that yeah speaking of which and i can however i did not claim to be able to access it instantaneously seems your fingers are an open rebellion fan enough does not serve my needs. When she makes another transmission, I must triangulate. I tire of this doctor. You have been chasing shadows for weeks to no avail. Hmm? Oh, nice shot. Oh, <laughs> see ya. <laughs> Christ. Wait, was that Ju that was Jules? He's gone already. You just took his ass out like it was nothing. Captain Lasky would like a word with you. It took you long enough. Hmm. Well, 
Okay, the Infinity. I figured this would make a return. Okay, last game, Palmer. I had a hunch. Captain Lasky, I sent you my position three weeks ago. I told you this was happening. We'll discuss that in private, Doctor. Palmer. What have you done? How far has it already gone? Good work, Osiris. What does that mean? And also, why is if 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 Halsey was such a threat, didn't Palmer have orders to execute her ass? Okay. Well, whatever. We'll ignore that for now. Oh, wait a minute. It's it's a me. I haven't seen Chief press himself like this since we were in boot camp. He's fine, Fred. And this many missions nonstop isn't fun. It's Fred. I remember you a little bit at the in the term. So, blue team has located Argent Moon. Signs of hostile activity. Is she still here? Blue team. Affirmative Infinity. One one seven out. Okay. Thanks. Everyone Kelly. Affirmative. Fred. Linda. That was the... I was like, I thought there was another... Good? Another woman. I'm just fucking great, Fred. Thanks for asking. <laughs> I mean, uh... Blue team. Fall out. Blue team. So, somebody mentioned in the comments that these guys were hanging around. Uh... They, they were... I don't remember where they were exactly, but they were always around or something, right? We just never saw them, and so now we're seeing them, which is fine. I have a, I have more of a, a grasp on why there are more Spartans now, which I think was my biggest concern was like the idea that if there were there were more Spartans around, as like the chief, that uh, why was I doing all the goddamn work, right? It kind of diminishes the idea of being the last Spartan if there's this idea that there are more Spartans out there. You know what I mean? Oh, uh, that's no good. Okay, get everyone. <laughs> See you later. Um, okay. But this is fine. I don't have a problem with more Spartans. I thought that was actually a really good part of Reach. It's just, I was confused as to why. But now we got all sorts of them. Christ, we got... Majesty team. Uh, Osiris team. Blue team. We clear the Covenant and return this station to Oni. Oh, we're on an Oni mission. I kind of like that, aren't they? They were like the CIA of the Halo universe. Ship data center is just ahead. We can pull down Argent Moon schematics there. Sure. Where am I going? See, this is why I need it. Ah, here we are. Mm-hmm. Oh. That's unfortunate. I had to go for it. Come on. My target is down. Well, that sounded crunchy. Okay, well, nice to see they still got that. All right. Is that it? Was that... No, that doesn't seem like it. It sounds like they're over there, but I see a door here. Did I... Did I come from this way?
Well, I better hang on to that. For safekeeping, of course. Oh, it's got a flashlight, too. That's nice. Couple grenades. Yeah, the demon's back, bitch. What are you gonna do about it? Hmm? Oh, shit. Maybe something. Hang on. Let me waste ammo. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on a second. I wanted to throw a grenade. So they just changed the sight button. Well, this is this okay. Well, this is a little bit more in line with like Call of Duty's controls or something, I notice. Uh, this kind of. Here's the deal. I, I, I'm sure I've commented at, at multiple points throughout uh, the Halo games. That was slick. Okay, this dash is pretty cool, too. I've commented many times about the ideas of scopes and them being on certain weapons and it not feeling right, not being on some and and such and such, right? Like the pistol having it, but not the AR. And then I see this, right? I happen to be out of ammo, but the point still stands. Um, That's not a bad feature. I don't know... This is gonna take some getting used to, though. Cause I'm not used to- I'm not used to scoping in with anything other than like an- like a battle rifle. You know what I mean? Or like a sniper rifle. But now you can do it with everything, including I might add like the shotgun where it's like, why am I aiming in? He's right there. It's close quarters. It'd be like, here to there. Why do I gotta scope in? But it's... whatever. I, I mean, it's... It's not it's not a complaint. It's not a complaint. It's just a very particular observation. Hmm. Okay. Oh, what is that? I gotta... Grab the data. Is this a good... This this was really bad in Halo 4. Is it better in this? Maybe with the ADS? I don't know. Yeah, but did they leave their ammo at least? <laughs> oh, an AR perhaps? A pistol even? Alright, everyone in? Arbiter? No, that's true. The prophets were much, much more, much more about scheming. Jewel, Jewel's madam was a was a strange. It was an okay. I don't. I still don't understand. Well, not. I I didn't think about this. So the arbiter is. He was always different from the rest of the Covenant, right? Even in, like, Halo 3, that was the whole point. Was him and him and some elites... Or him and... Actually, it was every every elite, wasn't it? Yeah, because they still had the Brutes. Which we haven't seen in a while, I might add. Um... I'll take that, sure. Okay, so I gotta be on the lookout for those things. Oh, that's probably not what I wanted to do. Oh, that's nifty. Maybe I'll take that instead, though. Uh, so anyway, point is, the Arbiter being around still, somewhere, that's nice. I like that, because I like the Arbiter. Only thing is, though, if he's 
still around, what's up with the elites then, right? And, like, what's up with the brutes? Like, what happened? Uh, this is what I want to know. This better be explained here, because I never really got a sense of this in, like, the terminals or anything. What happened with the coven? Why are they against us now, specifically? Like, I get, I'm sure something happened, whatever, right? But, like, what was it in particular? I want that event to be explained or something to that effect. All right, where'd that, uh... Give me that, thank you very much. I can't fucking tell you how, how grateful I am that they fixed the ammo situation. And that most, like, pretty much everything I picked up, including the Promethean weapons, just feels viable. I can't tell you how much of a relief that is, as far as my enjoyment of the game. Like, obviously the story stuff is gonna come. I get it. It's the second level. I've been playing for like 30 minutes. I'm sure shit's gonna be explained. I have faith. But the gameplay thing in Halo 4 was so freaking weird to me. That, that, it was just all over the place, right? And this is already so much better. Fucking hell, except that I got stuck. I just... <laughs> God damn it. All right. Try again. Where am I at? Oh, back to this. This is already so much more, like... It's pretty fast, too. I kind of like that. Especially with this dash thing. I feel like I could fly all over here. I, it's still, it still has a, the pickup ammo, or, you know, pickup weapons like it's gun game kind of deal a little bit. But again, like, if everything feels pretty viable to use, it's not really a problem, right? Like, you'll notice I'm already almost out of ammo. But I killed more than one guy. I got, like, five, right? All right, now pick up this thing. Okay, that was fine. All right. Not a lot of ammo, but this feels more powerful. All right, which is kind of a lot of a lot of observation, guys. A lot of observations. I uh, I'm very pleased with this. I'm very pleased with this. Mantling, got the fucking dash pack bullshit. You thought you were safe? No, 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 no. You thought wrong. Oh, okay, you can... All right, careful now. This is where I got blown up last time. All right. That... Oh, okay. That That's going to be a little bit weird because the grenade button, I don't think, has ever been uh, the bumper, which is what it is at mine. Oh, I forgot about this. Hey, you think you're slick? That ain't gonna save you. Ooh. Kind of want this. How does this work, though? Can you, uh... What is... What What the fuck am I... What am I doing here? Am I getting ready to... To... Okay. Interesting. Uh... I'll tell you what. Let me use this one up here first. A what? The Hydra? Is that a vehicle? Is that a gun? You know, thinking about it now, especially in a circumstance like this, I actually do kind of like the aim and function. It's a little bit weird. I don't know if this is what they're going to do with every... Because I don't... Like I said, I don't have a frame of reference for what this plays like. So, like, I don't know wh why they made this change or what it's like, generally speaking. I can say for what it's worth, though, that, like, the AR normally would not be great at this range. But it's a little bit better because you can aim in. I kind of like that actually it makes it feel more viable other than just as a as a you know as a rich man's submachine gun as it were right <laughs> okay oh 
Also, this level design is pretty good. I like how big this feels and like how open it is and there's places to jump and explore. It's it's not like it's not too it's not too too large of a play space, right? Which is important because I don't want like um I don't want it to be so big that it's, like, it's a problem. But it's open enough where there's, like, different ways you can jump around and shit. What's this one here? What is that? Ah, uh, I'll stick with the sword. I mean, I need to find an elite here to try the sword on. I want to see what that looks like. Oh, fuck. What was it? You gotta get a running start here. There we are. <laughs> Dumbass. I should have figured. Yeah. Let him know. Who, who's that? Which one of you? Linda? Or some shit? No, I'm out. Crap. Oh, damn it to hell. Oh, what is this? I can request assistance. Thanks. I got a revive function. Uh, that's different. Okay, I guess I'm not opposed to that. It's usually better than dying. Huh. Is that is that the benefit of having a squad then? Does that imply that like... I don't know. Well, that's fine, I guess. Sure. Okay, there's actually not a ton of ammo. This, this, I can't believe that I'm actually picking this up as if it's the way to go, but it may very well be. What a, what a complete contrast from Halo 4. <laughs> Did it explain why we're here exactly? We, we were here for R&D shit, that's right. Oh my. And that's me gone. It's over. I don't think blue team's around. I don't know where I am, but they're not in the caves here. Does anyone copy? What? Excuse me? Domain is open. Meridian is next. Cortana? John, the reclamation is about to begin. She's on Meridian. Who? Cortana. That's not possible. You said she was gone. I watched her die. We have a mission to focus on. We can talk about this later. 
No, 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 no. Let's get us back on course. For let's talk about this now. I got some questions, There's as no you can, can maybe imagine. Access is four levels down. Mark a path. Uh. What did she say? The domain is open, Meridian is next, Re the reclamation is about to begin. I only recognize one of those words, and I don't remember exactly what it was. There's something about the domain. I don't remember exactly. I'm not sure if I'm confusing that with the, with the mantle, which they said something to that effect too, that this was the Prometheans, or uh, who is it? The Forerunners, whatever, same, similar shit. Anyways. Oh, this is spooky. Maybe I will take that shotgun, actually, now that you're offering. Thank you. Alright, Fred, take point. So... Cortana... Well, that seems like it, it's, it, it could be a vision, or it could be... Real... See, here's what's fascinating to me about using this device, is that this makes Chief an unreliable narr narrator of sorts, right? Which is a little bit... That's that's a bold decision. Because the Master Chief is meant to be... He, he's got to be a, a source of certainty and of, uh, and of stability and strength. And the fact that he doesn't know what the fuck is going on... Well, guess what? Neither do I, believe it or not. Right? And that's kind of that's a that's a fascinating de uh, storytelling device, we'll say in this in this instance. I kind of like that. I'm really intrigued to see what happens next. Interfere, bro. I'm just here for some like some data and shit. I think. I don't even know what that is. Hunters. They're keeping pace with us. Well, that's kind of frightening. I've never seen hunters actually hunt before. Oh, careful. Oh, good lord. What happened there? Come on, man. He wasn't much. Then I kill. Then I get jewels. Reach level three. One more level down to the elevator for central control. Oh, no entry on that one. Covenant battle net just lit up. The Covenant ships exiting slip space. Oh Lord. <laughs> Surrendering Arjun Moon is not an option. Neither is fighting half the Covenant in close quarters. Then forget about reaching central control. The plan changes to asset denial. We scuttle the Arjun Moon. Ship's reactor core is near here. Same plan as the perpetual devotion. We overload the reactor and evac. Ship explodes, destroying any ships nearby. The reactor is below the lab just to Sure. That sounds like a fine enough idea. Where's Our that then? Oh, 
Oh no, are you the worms? Nice. That was me, sort of. I did that. Oh, see, this this makes much more of them about the, the worms thing. It never really did that in the other games, but here it's actually... It's, it's much more visible, too, I noticed, just looking at them. That's good. This is good that I I appreciate you guys telling me about the terminals and all the I feel like I I would have I would have missed these details. I'm very I'm very glad you guys pointed those things out. Hey, turn around. Here, I'll get your friend. I gotta, I gotta be getting close to one of them, right? Surely. There we are. I noticed there, it looks like you could kind of get them in the legs too. So they made more weak points then? Maybe just as well, cause it looks, it feels like they made them tougher actually. Oh, what's the fucking button? Get him, Linda. <laughs> Show him who's boss. Oh, Fred's down. Hey. Fred? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Here, get in the fight, sport. Go get him. <laughs> oh, that's fucking sick. Okay. Well, I, I, nothing like a good... Oh, what was that? Hey. Well, you can, like, hover. I, I don't know if I... Did I really want to do that? Nice. That'll work. Reactor room is just ahead. Oh, there's Fred. I, I was like, what what happened there though? Is he, he he's not gone? out of my way oh you don't go okay you don't go very far in the air though interesting i think you go hmm. oh that's not what i wanted to do that'll work though Fuck you. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Jesus almighty. This is fucking awesome. I love this. This is so much more fun than the last game. Hang on, I'm overheated. There we are.
I, I don't know if it's due to low gravity or what, but I feel like you, they really fly when you hit them. All right, I'm out again. Okay, it's I, I see... I see the remnants of that. It's mostly in the Covenant weapons, actually, but that's fine because everything still feels... I wonder how good the pistol is, but uh, I'll take that. There we go. All right. Waypoint. Here we are. Oh, that's the wrong button. Don't go to don't go over there. That doesn't look safe. Reactor's overloading. Move for the hangar bay. Oh, I guess we are. going to try to cool the reactor. I guess the UNSC is better reactor safety protocol than the Covenant. We can stop that. Board the reactor. Oh, so our plan's not gonna work. <laughs> the ship is too well made. What does that mean? Is that right here? Are set to pump cool into the reactor. This whole plan fails if that coolant gets a chance to work. Okay. To lose the Argent Moon, but I'd love to see the look on the Covenant's faces when she goes supernova. How do we stop it? There are sheds located on either side of the cooling chamber. Those are our targets. Reach the control sheds. Get the cooling system offline. Does it, does, is that over here? Where is that? Take this position. Oh, no, don't take that position. That's not what I wanted to do. Where is it? Yeah, I press to locate the objective. Where's that? Where is that? Can I get down there? Is that. Oh, I don't know if this is what they intended. Maybe. Okay, well, it worked, didn't it? Okay, I see banshees, I guess. Maybe you're supposed to fly down here. Whatever. Oh, see you later. <laughs> All right, what is it now? Override controls. Oh, all right. Override activated. Oh, well, that maybe that'll be helpful. Nah, that doesn't that doesn't feel as cool to use. Let me be honest. Yeah, yeah, give me that thing. Okay. Oh, did, did that count? Did I get it? I guess so. All right, what's the, what are the buttons for this one? How do you... Is, doesn't this have like rockets or something? How the hell did I do that last time? No, oh, see, he's got it. How do I do it? A direct hit. See, this is why. May, I hope that they had the foresight. I never would have found these without this button, without lighting it up with the waypoint. I never would have found it. Like I'm, I'm willing to admit that. Thank God. Okay, so now what? Fly away? Frederick, find the nearest hangar bay. We're taking a prowl. Frederick? 
You don't gotta be so formal, Chief. We're in the middle of a firefight here. I think you can shorthand it to Fred or perhaps Freddy. <laughs> just saying. Right here. Oh, excuse me. the prowler more covenant clear them out and prep for launch do it quick I'd rather not be here with the station belts around us all right open up Kind of sounds weird, doesn't it? It doesn't sound right. Ah, whatever. Marking the tower's control panel. This one was awesome, except it didn't have a lot of ammo. How is it here? Pretty good. Oh, I missed. <laughs> that not that one though. Oh, that a girl. Nice job, Linda. Oh, there we are. Launch controls are here. Launch preparations initiated. Fuel cells at zero percent. Initiating fuel. Hold off the covenant while the prowler preps for launch. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I'm getting, I'm getting hit. Shit, I wanted to... I wanted to just hit him, but I couldn't cancel my shot, I guess. Oh, that's nice. Let's see. I think this sounds better than the other one, honestly. Oh, shit. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, where am I going? I'm gonna have to see if I can get this movement down though with this 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 uh, jetpack thing though. I'm not really used to that. My like again, like I referenced Advanced Warfare, that like that Call of Duty. I've I played a lot of that back in the day, so like this idea is not unfamiliar to me. It is a little bit odd that they threw it in here, although I guess I can't say I'm totally surprised. Thing is, is like. It's nice, but it's not... I don't know. I don't... Does this really... Does it really need it? I guess I don't need... I, I don't see that. Okay, now what? Oh, alright. Excuse me. Sierra 
Ascension 7 to Infinity. Argent Moon scuttled. I've reassigned Blue Team. Destination Meridian. Potential contact from Cortana. Negative 117. Another team is already being prepped to deal with her. What the hell? You're to return to Infinity immediately. What? Negative Infinity. I don't like it. Whoever they are, let's get to Meridian before they do. Kelly, no. No need to do this by yourself, Chief. What does that mean? all of us, right? Oh, so we're ignoring them and we're going to Meridian anyway, which, whatever. Okay. So Lasky's sending somebody else to go deal with her. So we, we know that, and, and what do we mean deal with her, by the way, too? Or like retrieve her or what? What? Did Halsey say something? Because she's really the only other person who know a lot about Cortana or frankly give a shit other than the chief. Huh. I tried to warn you this was happening. Cortana is no longer an asset. Captain, she is a danger. She has access to the Forerunner domain, a galaxy-spanning network Cortana's that alive? allows her to control whatever devices caused this damage. How is she? Master Chief believes she contacted him. No, oh, John must not speak to her. He's gone in search of her. You let him go? How is Nobody it lets the Chief do anything. He does what he wants. And until 0631 this morning, when he was declared absent without leave. This isn't about the Master John Chief. John is not equipped emotionally to deal with her as a threat. Hey! Is anyone going to answer me? I'm with Roland. Yes, sir. But so is everyone else. You created Cortana, Doc. And now you're throwing her out the airlock with these accusations. Roland. You think she tricked the Master Chief into abandoning his post? Respectfully, sir, to what end? Why is Cortana the problem? Because she refused to die when she was supposed to? I don't think that's... Okay. Let's 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 hear out the rest of this here. I got some questions. You're okay with this? Not just another target, you know. Every target is just another target, Buck. Yeah. For you maybe. I love being an ODST. Just point and shoot. None of this gray area BS. <laughs> I mean, how are you even supposed to bring them in? Ask politely? No. The hell? Armor restraint. Short circuit their seat systems. Car. Huh. The lock. Every other Spartan. Every soldier, when they hear about this, they're gonna hate us. You know that, right? You're not the only one here because of him. The hell does that mean? Christ, we keep getting more and more cutscenes, which is fine. <laughs> but I still have a lot of questions. It's just kind of adding on with every single cutscene. There's more questions now, so. All right, finally. Okay, here's the, this is the next level. I am going to leave it here, though, guys. We're going to call it here. Okay, well, that was... Uh, a very exciting part one. Uh, I, I am, I am, honestly, I am having a lot of fun with this already. I think that the gameplay is leaps and bounds better than Halo 4, honestly. I wasn't really, like, I was hoping for this, right? I was. I just, I figured that they wouldn't do it, or they wouldn't do it this well, honestly. Because 
that was that was the main criticism of Halo 4 was that it just it didn't feel like it didn't feel like you could play the game, which as a video game, you can see why that's a problem when I f it feels like I as the player am being held back from being able to experience the fun, right? And Halo 5 is just so much better. It's f it's faster. Um, there's more tools at my disposal. Everything, basically everything I used felt fine, if not actually good to use. The, the way that it has the ADS system now with like every gun, that's a neat idea. Do I think it's totally necessary? No, but I don't have a problem with it. Um, you have this 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 thruster pack system that they took from Halo 4. I mean, I can see. I honestly, I'm kind of surprised. I do I don't know how that's supposed to play in multiplayer. I feel like it's fine here. I don't know if they did the same thing in the actual online, but like, I think it's okay here. I'm not like going all over the place with it. It's not. It's not a crazy thing it's just it's kind of a neat idea like oh they threw a grenade let me dash away like that's that's fine right that's a neat system i don't have a problem with that um and then i i noticed something else too was the revive mechanics so rather than dying like all the time sometimes you do and i i'm i don't know what the distinction is like there was one time i died and i actually had to restart and then there was another time where they actually revived me my 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 spartan mates there uh, which is a fine idea. I don't know if that's supposed to make it easier, which I don't have a problem with per se. Again, casual player here, but like that's that, that's just another observation I had as far as that. Um, and I, I, as a casual player, I kind of appreciate that. So let's talk about the story now and all that stuff going on. Uh, Halo 5 really, um, I feel like it really jumps into it. And... I'm not, like, I, I just have a lot of questions and a lot of observations. The only thing is, though, is, is I'm coming off of my um, my Modern Warfare 3 playthrough, which I don't know if you've, if, um, I don't know if you guys watched that one. It should be up by the time you're seeing this. But I, I don't think that fast pacing as far as storytelling like I i'm coming off of that game where it did it and it wasn't great so like i'm a little bit concerned here that it just threw a lot of shit at us and i have to process it in part one and like that's that's fine if it does a good job explaining it it's just i have a lot of questions is the only thing and i i need more of an explanation and that better happen throughout the game. And this is something that I had in Halo 4 as well by the end of it, was I had a lot of questions about the world and the universe and the entities within it, but then also the specifics regarding, like, the Chief and Cortana. And see, now this is getting into it right away where I have that same stuff again. So Cortana is back, which... I feel like should have been a more of a twist or something. I mean, this the, we're the the second level in, I think, and it's already like, oh, Cortana. Not only is Cortana back, right? So let's let's number this here. Not only is Cortana back, right? She's alive, and and she's like a threat. How how does that make sense? Because Roland was saying something there at the end that why is it such a problem that she didn't just die when she was supposed to? Well. I don't know. I don't think anybody wanted that, which is that's why it's kind of a weird line that stands out to me. I, nobody wants that. I don't think myself included as the player, obviously. But looking at it, it's like, why is it such a big deal that sh that we got to go after her? It. I don't know. It wasn't explained yet. I don't think something something to do with this meridian, which I guess is a place. Um. And she's, what is she going to do? And why is she going to do anything? How is she going to do anything? How is she back? See, none of that was explained. And the fact that it was already jumping, it's already jumping in, in, in the second level with the, with the erasure of the end of the last game, the prospect of Cortana dying, which like I said, in my playthrough for Halo 4, that was a bold decision. It was. Um, and I did kind of wonder, like, is she actually dead? Which, it's, it's, they should have, they should have done it better. That's all it was. This is not a Halo 5 problem as much as it is a Halo 4 problem. Or maybe it's, it's both of them, really. Is that, if, if they were going to bring her back, they should have made it more clear 
of some kind of stakes regarding the end of Halo 4, and then also done a better job of discussing it thus far in Halo 5. They should have waited. I feel like throwing her in so early, and again, I can't give too much criticism. It is part one, but admittedly, like I said, having just played another game that did a really rushed job with its storytelling, I'm a little bit concerned here that they're already throwing in this, this character that we just lost, right? They're throwing her back in with basically no explanation. I have a fuck ton of questions about it. Um, and I don't, admittedly, when I say that, I don't want you to get, you guys to give too much information because I want to play the rest of the game, obviously, and see what things come along with it. But, um, I just, I'm, I'm really confused. And some of it's in a good way with things like, oh, why is Buck here? And who the hell is Osiris team? Stuff like that. That's fine. But then they get to something like Cortana. That's the big thing that throws me off. Because I figured that the story wouldn't be so much about her. But now here it is and it seems like she's a big deal. So she's, she's returned and she's going to this Meridian place. And it's really urgent that we stop her. But also... Why is the ma but also everybody doesn't want the master chief to go do it. They want, uh, they wanted the other. Was it the, did they say Osiris team has to do it? They mentioned that I think at the end of the last level, right? Did to go deal with her or something? But then they're also saying that Osiris team's got to deal with the master chief and they got the armor lock shit to throw on, and they're gonna stop. They're gonna stop us. But like, why? Master Chief is not equipped to deal with Cortana as a threat. How How is she a threat? Exp how? Why? These are the questions I have. And I feel like this is really basic shit. I don't know. This is why, like, throwing Cortana... Like, if you wanted to do this thing with this setup with Cortana, that's fine. But why right away? This is the only thing. I feel like if they were going to bring her back, they should have made it more of a twist and they should have done it later in the game. Right? I don't know. So I'm not really sure the direction of this exactly. Like, I know Im the immediate next steps that we have to do, which is go to Meridian and deal with Cortana, but, like, I don't know what this was to look like. I don't know why. And I, I feel like I kind of need that. I don't know. So I feel like this could have been handled better. So, I don't know. That's, that's what I got for Halo 5. Let me know what you guys think about this. This is a lot better than I was expecting, as far as, at least as far as the gameplay. Although, I gotta say, with this story, it's actually might be more confusing than than Halo 4 which is uh, that's actually not a great sign. I'm a little bit I'm a little bit cautious about that frankly, but we'll have to wait and see how it goes. Obviously, like I said, part 1 this is how it often goes for me. I got a lot of stuff and it needs to be fleshed out more as we get through the next few parts. So, I hope you'll bear with me on that. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. I'm having a good time with this though. I am. Um so that's where we're going to leave it, okay? Thanks for watching.